أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم My dear brothers and sisters if you want to know if Allah loves you look at the signs when Allah loves you nothing to do with dunya nothing to do with money nothing to do with beauty nothing to do with degree or the level of education you've reached all of this in the sight of Allah is zero Listen to what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says. فَإِذَا أَحْبَبْتُ كُنْتُ سَمْعَهُ الَّذِي يَسْمَعُ بِهِ When I love my servant, I become his earrings that he hears, he hears with. وَبَسَرَهُ الَّذِي يُبْسِرُ بِهِ And I become his eyesight that he, he sees with. وَيَدَهُ الَّتِي يَبْضِشُ بِهَا And the hands that he uses or strikes with. وَرِجْلَهُ الَّتِي يَمْشِي بِهَا And the feet that he walks with. Now the sign, Ikhwani fi Allah, wa in sa'alani la u'udiyanna, when he or she asks me something, I will give it to him or her. Wa la in sta'adani la u'idanna, and when he seeks refuge in me, I'll give him the refuge. So, my dear brothers and sisters in Islam, I want to share with you this incident. That was narrated by Abdullah ibn Abbas radiallahu anhu. There is a man that Abdullah ibn Abbas radiallahu anhu said that one day people were out making istisqa, they were asking Allah for rain, and they were in drought for a very long time. And as they were out asking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for rain, that all these righteous people were making dua as well, and it was a long time that rain did not come. And then Ibn Abbas radiallahu anhu said, I saw this man who had no status in society in the corner of the marketplace and he had his hand straight in the corner and said Allahumma inni as'aluka bihubbika ilayya illa amdartana O oh Allah, I ask you by your love for me that you allow rain to come upon all of us Allahu Akbar Who makes such kind of a dua? Ibn Abbas said, I was the only one close enough to the man where I could he- hear his dua. And as soon as he finished making that dua, it started to rain upon all of us. He said, and I looked at him, and I thought, who is this man? Subhanallah, simple servant of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He wasn't an alim, he wasn't a scholar, he wasn't giving khutbahs. But he had status with Allah and he understood it. And that was to the benefit of everybody else that was over there. So dear brothers and sisters, may Allah make us among those people. May Allah make us among the people that he loves most. Wa sallallahu wa sallam wa baraka ala Sayyidina Muhammad. Wallahu a'lam.